Hallelujah. Father, we thank you and we bless you. We give you praise and glory. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome once again to our Wednesday hour of prayer. And uh, we thank God that you prepare yourself and that of your family to join us in the next hour as we go before the presence of God in prayer. May the Lord God bless you. May the Lord God lift you up above all in Jesus' mighty name. Hey, boy, we, we, we are missing you guys. We are missing you big time. It will not be long we'll be able to uh, worship together. But may the Lord God continue to bless you. Stay blessed and stay connected in the name of Jesus. In the next hour, we're going to pray. We're going to seek the face of God in Jesus' mighty name. But just before we do that, just bow down your head wherever that you are, and let's begin to pray. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. Begin to magnify the name of the Lord. Exalt this name. Exalt this name. Hallelujah. Father, we bless you. Father, we honor you. We glorify you, King of Kings. We thank you. We bless you. We give you praise. We give you glory. In the name of Jesus, in the midst of it all, Father, it is only you, O oh God, that we will honor. We thank you. We bless you. We glorify you. We magnify your holy name. We magnify your holy name. You are our God. You are our God. Father, we are worshiping you, not because of what you do for us. We are worshiping you, not because what you have done. Father, we are worshiping you because you are our God. We want to thank you. We want to bless you. We want to honor you this hour. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. We bless your holy name. We bless your holy name. Father, we thank you. Father, we bless you. Father, we honor honor you in Jesus mighty name. Glory be unto you in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. At this hour we give praise unto you. At this hour we honor you in the name of Jesus. It is you, O oh God, that have taken care of us. It is you, O oh God, that have blessed us. It is you, O oh God, that have positioned us at this place in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. We are still alive and we want want to thank you. We are still alive and we want to bless you. It is all by your grace. The enemy planned so many things, but it did not work. It has failed. It has failed and continue to fail. We give you praise. We give you glory. In the mighty name of Jesus, we honor you, King of Kings. We honor you, Lord of Lords. We honor you, mighty God. We honor you, we bless you, we give you praise. We give you glory in the name of Jesus. King of Kings, we bless your name. We bless your name. We thank you. We thank you, Heavenly Father. We magnify you. We exalt you. Hallelujah be unto your name. Hallelujah be unto your name. Glory be unto your name. Glory be unto your name. Father, we want to thank you. We want to bless 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 you. In the name of Jesus, we give you praise. We give you glory. Father, we bless your name. Father, we glorify your name. Father, we magnify your name. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Hallelujah. We bless your name, O Lord. 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 Le mashaka de mata bene andayaba. La dobro shaka de branda yababo. Le mata bene andayaba. He masa bene andayaba. Le broka bade bre andayaba. Yes, Lord, we thank you. Yes, Lord, we bless bless you. Yes, Lord, we honor you. In the name of Jesus, as we lift our hands together, Lord, we give only your glory. In the name of Jesus, we've not been forced to bless you. We've not been asked to bless you. We have chosen to give your praise unto you. In the name of Jesus, we thank you, Jehovah. 
We honor you, Jehovah. Your name and only your name be glorified forever and ever in the name of Jesus. We are coming, oh God, in your presence and we are lifting up our hands. We are lifting up our thanksgiving. We are offering our sacrifices unto you in the name of Jesus. We give you praise and we give you glory in Jesus' mighty name. Heavenly Father, we thank you. Heavenly Father, we exalt you. Heavenly Father, we bless you. In Jesus' mighty name. Glorious God, we thank you. Glorious God, we bless you. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Father, we thank you. And we bless you. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Wherever you are, as we said earlier on, please join us as we go through. We use the next hour. Uh, to seek the face of God. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Let's go into the word of God and then we'll pray. As we said, it is our of faith. Our of faith. We are putting a demand on our faith. We are placing a demand on our faith. Our faith in what? Our faith in God. Our faith in the word of God. Hallelujah. Our faith in the word of God. As we take the word of God. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Yesterday we said to you that whatever God has said. Hallelujah. From the beginning, the first word that he gave to you. Hallelujah. He's not going to turn away from it. He is not going to turn away from it. He's going to keep it. So all we have to do is to have faith in that word. In the name of Jesus. Have faith in that word. Have faith in that word. In the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. And we bless you. In the name of Jesus. Turn your Bible with me to Romans chapter 12. Chapter 10, if you can. Romans chapter 10. The book of Romans chapter 10. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. We're going to pray with you very, very soon. Please stay connected. Please stay connected. Let's pray. Let's pray. It is an hour of prayer. Join in. Hallelujah. Join in. Join in. Praise the name of the Lord. Join in. It's going to be so wonderful. Praise the name of the Lord. Amen. Romans chapter 10. Let's quickly go into the word of God and find out what the word of God says. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. What a glorious God we serve. What a glorious God we serve. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Now listen to what the word of God said. The same scripture, the same word is also repeated or said, first said in uh, Deuteronomy. But I want us to use the New Testament one this morning for us to use it to pray. It is a, 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 a faith word, a faith word, and it's so powerful, praise the name of the Lord. And I believe as you have faith in the word of God. Remember what Jesus said. He said, if you have faith, if you have faith, all you need is to have faith in his word. Hallelujah. Child of God, I said, all we need, as he is our God, as we know him as omnipotent, omnipresent, omniscient God, as we know that he's a loving God, as we know that he will do everything, that is why we need to have faith in that which he has said. Praise the name of the Lord. Imagine, imagine. You see, we have faith in all the things around us. You see, you have faith that when you go to bed, you will wake up. That's your faith. It's a faith. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. When you sat in a car, you have faith that you go to wherever that you want to go and come back safely. That's faith. So you do have faith. I do have faith. But sometimes the areas that we fall short is when it comes to the word of God. Child of God, don't feel too much pushed. But listen, when it comes to the word of God, as I said, the very first word that you have heard from the Lord, Hallelujah. For example, if God is saying that by my stripes you are healed, it is his word. That is what he said. And he's not going to backtrack or change his mind from it. He is surely going to make sure what he has said, it is there, it is forever, it is settled here and also in heaven. 
And he wants us to have faith in that word. When it was said, we were not there. But we have now come to believe in his word. Oh, praise the name of the Lord. So we got to know that everything that he has said is surely, if we believe, is going to come to pass. Praise the name of the Lord. So now let's look at what Romans was saying. Let's look at verse number six first. He says that, but the righteousness based on faith, based on faith, right standing with God, righteousness, right standing with God. We are standing right with our Father. Hallelujah. What does that mean? It means that we, we don't do anything extra. Praise the name of the Lord. Once we come to him, he has accepted us as his children, as your child or anybody for that matter will be able to come to you boldly and claim and lay some demands. Why? Because they have faith in you that you are not going to disappoint them. So it is the same way that our father in heaven want us to approach him. Praise the name of the Lord. Knowing that he is not going to disappoint us. We knowing that he is going to give unto us that whichever that we ask. And on top of it all, Bible says yes, that whatever that we need, whatever that we want, whatever that we want to see, whatever we want to happen in our life. He says yes, that when we pray, we got to have faith in him. Hallelujah. When we pray, we got to believe. When we pray, we got to trust him that we have him. May the Lord God bless you and lift you up. So he says that, but the righteousness based on faith, imputed by God and bringing right relationship with him. You have right relationship with him. I have right relationship with him. Child of God, you are not a lost child. I said you are not a lost child. You are a blessed child of God. Amen. That is why you got to believe and know that in every situation, your God is there for you. Because his eyes is on you day and night. Oh, again, it's not something that I'm telling you. This is what he has said. So if you have faith in his word, it will work for you. It will work for you. Simple. It is not what the pastors are saying. It is what the, what the word of God says. It is not what they are saying. It is not their mind. They have not put things together and they are just giving it to you. No. They are taking the word of God and with the knowledge that they have in the word, they are sharing so that your faith will increase in everything in the name of Jesus. So we have a right relationship with God. When we have right relationship with God, all things will work together. Hallelujah for us. So we don't speak according to our situation. We don't speak according to the things that are bothering us. We speak because God has said it. And we are confirming the word of God. I want you to say amen wherever that you are. Now let's go into the word of God once again. He says that that will have right relationship with him. Say, do not say in your heart, listen to this, do not say into your heart, in your heart. Do not. Don't talk like that. Don't talk defeat. Don't talk failure. Praise the name of the Lord. Even though the things around you, it's, it looks as if that is how it's about to happen. happen. Praise the name of the Lord. But yet, he says that. Don't say that. Because now you have a right relationship with your father. You have a good relationship with your God. Hallelujah. So don't talk defeat. Tell somebody, don't talk defeat. Say to yourself, don't talk defeat. In the name of Jesus. Don't talk defeat. Don't talk defeat. In the name of Jesus. He said, do not say. In your heart, who will ascend into heavens? Heaven, hallelujah. That is to bring Christ down. No. Praise the name of the Lord. You don't need that. Praise God. 
It has already been done for you. So you only have to believe that this is what he has done. Oh, child of God, say amen. Say amen. That is why Bible says that the battle is not yours. You just have to believe that the commander-in-chief, hallelujah, will do his work. I say you just have to believe that the commander-in-chief will do his work. You just have to believe that the commander-in-chief will do his work. It is not our battle, hallelujah. He goes on to say, he said, not by might, not by power, but by the spirit of the Lord. If the Lord is doing his work, man's understanding, man's knowledge, man's power, got nothing to do with it. May the Lord God bless you wherever you are. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. So don't say that. Don't say that, hallelujah. Who will go down? To bring Christ down. Then come to verse number 7. Or who will descend into the abyss. That is to bring Christ up from the dead. We don't need to do that. That has already been done for us. As see if we could be saved by our own effort. No. We were not going to be saved by our own effort or we were not saved by our own effort. It has already been done. It's been done and we got to believe. Child of God, believe. Believe. Confess. Believe. 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 Let everything around you, hallelujah, forget it. And believe what the, the Lord God has said. Amen. It is not by our effort. The more hinges on our faith in the Lord. Your faith in the Lord. Hallelujah. Your faith is very, very important. Hall your trust in the Lord is very, very important. My trust in the Lord is very, very important. Why? Because through faith, hallelujah, things will come about in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you and we bless you in the name of Jesus. As we move on, hallelujah. To the next verse. Come to verse number 8. But it says yes. But what does it say? In other words. What do we need to say? <coughs> what do we need to say? Or what we ought to say. Look into your Bible. Verse number 8. Romans chapter 10. Verse number 8. This is what we need to say. This is what God is expecting from us, his children. Praise the name of the Lord. But what does it say? What does the word of God say? Yes. The word of God, hallelujah. God's message in Christ is near you. Hallelujah. He said the word of God, the potent word of God is near you. It's near you. It's with you. So, if you want God to do something in your life, he says that the word is with you. It's not with anybody. Praise the name of the Lord. Our leaders may give, it, um, give them unto us and explain it unto us, but it is up to us to take it. Praise the name of the Lord. And make good use of it. May the Lord God bless you. May the Lord God bless you as you are taking this into your spirit. May you begin to stand and pray and proclaim the word of God in your life and that of your family and smash away every fear, every intimidation in the name of Jesus by declaring that the Lord God is king over your house, over your family, over everything that you come about in the name of Jesus. It will not intimidate you. It will not come near you. It will not bring you down. Because the word is in your mouth And you are about to shake it off In the name of Jesus Hallelujah Father we thank you We bless you We give you praise In the name of Jesus Listen God's message in Christ Wow It's near you It's near you Praise the name of the Lord And not only near you Hallelujah And it says that on your lips. The word is on your lips. So you are not to wait for someone to do it for you. 
You don't wait for someone to do it for you. The word is on your lips. Praise the name of the Lord. So whatever that you want God to do in your life, whatever you yourself you want to do, the word is on your lips. Hallelujah. You see, that's why sometimes you, you can rely on your, your, your faith. You can rely on someone else's faith. Hallelujah. Yes, it will work for you, but for some time, there is a limit. A time will come that you have to exercise your own faith. Praise the name of the Lord to bring certain things about in your life. May the Lord God bless you. Let's finish the word of God before we burst into prayer. Hallelujah. I'm excited. And I believe you are so excited because when the messages like this is coming our way, we know that God is speaking. Hallelujah. He does not bring fear. He does not bring intimidation. In the name of Jesus, he just gives out the mind of God for us to know that God has not abandoned us. Father, we thank you in the name of Jesus. Oh, hallelujah. What a glorious God we serve. And he says, the word is near you. And in, <coughs> in fact, he says, on your lips and in your heart, that is the word, the message, the basis and the object of faith, which we preach, the message of faith, hallelujah, that is what we preach, that is what we talk about, that is what we are believing God to do in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, what does that mean, it means that you have the word of God in you, whatever you say, Whatever you believe, whatever you command, hallelujah, it shall come to pass in the name of Jesus. I remember Bible says, God said to Moses, Moses, uh, complain and the Israelite complained and they were crying and they were murmuring and they're saying all kinds of things. But at a point, hallelujah, they cry out to God. But the word that came out from him is that what is in your hands? Moses. What is in your hands? Hallelujah. Praise God. You are waiting for me to do something. But remember when I first asked you to go, I gave you something. So what is in your hands? May I ask you the same question, child of God. What is in your mouth? Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. What is in your heart? God has given us his word. He has given us his power in the name of Jesus. He says, behold. What does that mean? Behold, stop everything and pay attention to this. All power has been given unto me. Praise the name of the Lord. And he has given that power, transferred that power to you and I. May the Lord God bless you. May the Lord God lift you up above all things in the name of Jesus. Debraha, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. It goes on to say, he goes on to say, we are not done yet. The word is near you. The word is in your mouth. It is the word of faith. The word of God is the word of faith. It's the word of faith. You speak it, you don't see it, but it comes to pass. What you declare, you don't see it first before you declare it. Praise the name of the Lord. Amen. That's why the Bible says that God can even send forth his word. Hallelujah. And go and does the work in the name of Jesus. Bible says that the centurion said that you don't need to come to my house. I know there is power in the word. I know it is the word of faith. So you just say the word. Say the word. Say the word. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. And more so, more importantly, now the word is in us. The word is in you and you are to command you are to declare in the name of Jesus in Job he says that declare a thing and it shall come to pass in the name of Jesus may you be encouraged sister brother you have something going for you 
I say you have something going for you. There is power going for you. There is anointing going for you. There is grace going for you. There is protection going for you. In the name of Jesus, you are not ordinary. You are not ordinary. You are among the children of God and the favor of God is upon you. In the name of Jesus, all the days of your life, God is taking care of you. As he has said, he says, all the days. Of your life. If you are with me, say amen. Hallelujah. Let's come to verse number nine and probably ten, and then we'll start praying. Hallelujah. Amen. Number nine. Remember, you have the word of faith in you. And it says, Because if you acknowledge and confess the word that is in you. Oh, glorious God. If you acknowledge, you need to acknowledge. Hallelujah. You need to know what you have. You need to understand what you have. You need to know what is available to you. So he says, if you acknowledge. Acknowledge what? Your fears. No. Hallelujah. You know, some people will say that, yeah, you have to be realistic. Realistic about your fears. Realistic about your sickness. Hallelujah. When you become realistic about what do you do about it? I'm not saying that be ignorant. Everybody know there is something going on. But what are we to do about that which is going on? That is what the Bible says. We need to acknowledge that there is a God. There is a power. There is anointing. There is grace being avail made available for us. May the Lord God bless you. I say, may the Lord God bless you. Hallelujah. So you can speak power. You can speak authority. You can speak wisdom. You can speak cover in the name of Jesus over your life and that of your family. In the name of Jesus. May the Lord God bless you. May the Lord God lift you up in the name of Jesus. Child of God, as we go on, he said, acknowledge and confess with your lips. Hallelujah. That Jesus is Lord. He's Lord in war. He is Lord in everything. Jesus is Lord in everything. Oh, hallelujah. He is Lord in your situation. He is Lord in the things going around you. He is Lord, the Lord of Lords, the King of Kings. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. The sovereign God. No one can take his position. When he said that he loves us, hallelujah, no one has been able to dispute that. The devil... All that he, do, he does is to convince us, trying to convince us for us to take our minds away from God. But God said he loves us and he'll continue to love us in the name of Jesus. He is not planning to change his mind. Child of God, you are blessed. So having the word of faith in you, praise the name of the Lord. Bible says that don't just let it be there and say that I have faith. Hallelujah. Proclaim the faith. It says that, and if you say, hallelujah, verse number nine, let's look at it. We are going to pray very soon. When you confess, confessing means that speak out. The law of confession, speak it out. Speak it out. Hallelujah. My child is not sick. My child is not sick. My child is healed in the name of Jesus. My child is not vagabond in the name of Jesus. And then you are confessing. Hallelujah. My marriage is not broken in the name of Jesus. You are confessing. Hallelujah. My job, my health, whatever that concerns you, you are confessing. If you confess with your mouth, don't say I just believe it. No, 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 no. It doesn't end there. Child of God, it does not end there. Don't say that I am a believer and you are just sitting there. Confess what you believe in. That is the word. That is how you appropriate the word. Confess what you believe in. In the name of Jesus. If you confess with your mouth, with your lips, that Jesus is Lord. Hallelujah. In everything. And believe in your heart. 
So it means whatever you are saying, you also have to believe what you are saying. Sometimes we say things and we don't believe in it. So whatever you yourself you are saying, you have to believe in it. Amen. Because you know your word is power. Hallelujah. Your word will create things. Your word will cause things about to come to pass. Praise the name of the Lord. Father, we thank you. We bless you. Believe in it. Believing in it is what? Adhere to it. Adhere to the word. Hallelujah. Child of God, fear will always come. Fear is designed, hallelujah, to bring you down. Fear will cause you to walk about trying to seek for help, not knowing that you yourself, the help is in you. Oh, Jesus' name, hallelujah. The help, you say, yes, that the word is near you. The word is on your lips. That's number eight. The word is near you. And the word is on your lips. So speak. And when you speak, it will work for you. Praise the name of the Lord. Amen. Thank you, Lord. So, adhere to and also trust in it. Adhere to the, what you have said. Believe what the, the word of God is saying. Trust in it. And rely. Praise the name of the Lord. On the truth. What is the truth? The truth is the word of God. The truth is the word of God. Child of God, the truth is not the information that is going about. They can sit down and tell you this is the truth. But I'm telling you that is not the truth. Praise the name of the Lord. The truth is the word of God. That is why the Bible says yes, that the, 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 the righteous is so bold to proclaim the word of God. Because you know what the word of God is saying. May the Lord God bless you. May the Lord God lift you up. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Rely on the truth. And it says when you do that. That God raised him. Up from the dead. And you will be saved. What does that mean? Not only leading us to confession. Not only leading us to salvation. Hallelujah. But in every situation. Our blessings. Does not stop at salvation. Our blessing, our covenant that we have with Christ does not stop our salvation. Oh, praise the name of the Lord. It doesn't stop our salvation. Praise God. It is only the beginning. Bible says that he has blessed us with all spiritual blessing in the name of Jesus. Because that is where we started. And that is where we're going to end up. In the name of Jesus, I pray, oh God, Father, that you will not give up. That you will not give up in the name of Jesus. You will fight with every strength in you because Bible says yes, that he has deposited his power, his word in you. The word is near you and the word is in your mouth. Are you ready to pray? Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. And number 10, that's where we're going to end. For with the mouth, with the heart, a person believes. Again, that helps to trust in and rely on Christ. And so is justified. When you believe, everything that you decree and declare will be justified. Hallelujah. Declared righteous, acceptable to God. And with the mouth, he confesses, declares openly, declare openly, Hallelujah. That I will not die, but leave and declare the words of the Lord. Child of God, if you are walking about declaring I will not die, I will leave, I will not die, I will leave, I will not die. Hallelujah. You are not making mockery of yourself. I say you are not making mockery of yourself. You are the de de declaring the word of God in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God is with you and his word is making uh, things happening in your life life in the name of Jesus. You will not die, but you will live in the name of Jesus. But you are to declare it openly and speak out freely. Hallelujah. In faith. In faith. And confirm it. Hallelujah. When you confirm it, it works for you in the name of Jesus. I know you are jeering up. 
at this hour to pray. I know, I know you are jeering up. But child of God, the word is very simple. If you didn't get it, maybe you are just joining us. We were in Romans chapter 10. Hallelujah. And we start reading from verse number 8. 6, sorry. 6, hallelujah. 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. But listen to this. Hallelujah. There is something there. Powerful. Amen. It says that the word is near you. The word is on your lips. And you are to confirm it. Confess, confesses. For confess the word of God. Just declare it. Now. Hallelujah. Begin to thank God. Begin to bless the name of the Lord. 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 Confess the word of God. Confess, 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 confess. Not confessing your sin. Confessing what God has made available for you. Confessing what he has said he is going to do. Confessing what he has said that it will come into your life. And that, that is what you need to confess. Praise the name of the Lord. La de Mahakayaha. Lebro Shabaka de Mradoka de Maha. Lebran Tayabaha. We may not know all the things that are going on. Yes, we may not know. Hallelujah. We may not know. But should we be worried? No, we shouldn't be worried. We have the power of God. I say we have the power of God. I say we have the power of God. Child of God, you need to mount up strength. Child of God, you need to mount up strength. You need to to mount up strength in the name of Jesus. By knowing who you are, continue to bless the name of the Lord. La debrahaka. La debrahaka yanda yabaha. In the name of Jesus. Le makabado misa debraha. La debre anda yabaha. Yeto kosi mini anda ya. Libra kosa mini anda ya. In the name of Jesus. La Bayabaha, Yanka Bene and Dayabaha, Le Massa de Bracayaha, E Maso Cabene and Dayababa, Le Branta Yababa, E Massa Benema, confess, 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 hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, declare hallelujah, openly shout in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, prayer of faith, hallelujah, is to command, a prayer of faith is to command, command the in, to obey you, obey your word, obey the word of God which is in you. Command in the name of Jesus. Marabaha, labro shabani bini adaya, yanda bene adaya baha, le mashaka ya baba. Bible command us to pray a prayer of faith, and I commanding you to pray in the name of Jesus. Don't stop. Don't give up. Don't let the things around you scar you off. In the name of Jesus, pray. La bayaha, la nebraham. In the name of Jesus, le mukaba nebre, la bene andayabaha, yanda bene andayabaha, e mashaba rababa, le masande branda yaba, e makaba da bene andayaba, le branda yababa, e mashaba rababa, e masa bene andayau, e makaba bori andayaba. E masa bene anda yabao, e maraba yanda yababao, ya dobre, ya dobre, ya dobe shaba yabao, in the name of Jesus, la de maka yabao, la de maka yabao, la de maka yabao, in Jesus name, in Jesus name, we want to take this prayer, in the name of Jesus, you want to pray, child of God, and commit your family, your household, and people around you. Hallelujah. Pray and make mention their names. Hallelujah. Pray and make mention. Declare, he said, declare openly. Praise the name of the Lord. Openly. Make mention. Hallelujah. Loved ones. Put them under the cover of God. He who dwells in the sacred place. That is where you are. And that is where they will be. In the name of Jesus. Shall we begin to pray? Shall we begin? Make mention, hallelujah, that they are covered. In the name of Jesus. La demre kadaha. Emma shabaramaha. Yanda bene andayabaha. Emma kababobi andayabaha. Every crooked places are being made straight. Are being made smooth in the name of Jesus. I decree and declare no weapon fashioned against me. It shall prosper. So are you in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. The weapon of the enemy will not work against you in the name of Jesus. 
Labere andaya. Yandaya babau. Emma shakadabaya. Emma sabene andaya bau. Yanda bene andaya ba. Labene oh. Labene oh. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lababe. Yandaya baba. Lemma kabaha. Keep on praying. Keep on praying. Don't stop. In the name of Jesus. La bene andaya bahu. 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 The word is near you. The word is on your lips. And you are to confess it. 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 Confess the word of God, child of God. Confess it. Hallelujah. Confess it. No power, no demon, no principality. Even if you have heard them saying that they are at war with you, you are to stand in the name of Jesus, that you are covered in the name of the Lord, and you are coming at them with the power of God. In the name of Jesus, begin to pray with me. In the name of Jesus, Le Masa Debre Andayaba, Yanta Bene Andayaba, Le Masha Kababo, Le Masa Bene Andayaba, Le Branda Yababa. The word is in your mouth. 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 In Jesus' name, declare the word of God over every situation. Over every situation, Lebra Kayaha, Emma Sadebre, Yana Bene Andaya, Lemma Kabayaha, in the name of Jesus, Lemo Kadabene Andaya Baba, Yanda Bene Andaya Baba, Lebrosh, La Bene Andaya Ba, La Boca Bene A, Lebra Sadebre Andaya, Lemma Kababori Andaya Ba, La Bene Andaya Baba, the word is in your mouth. The word is in your mouth. Whatever you desire, whatever you desire, whatever you desire, when you pray, believe, believe, have faith in it. When you pray, as you are praying, child of God, have faith in your prayers. Have faith, have faith. Know that your prayer is doing wonders. Know that your prayers are doing wonders. Are moving mountains in the name of Jesus. Approach every stem of faith in the name of Jesus. Every, hallelujah, in the name of Jesus. Every tree of fear will command it to go away in the name of Jesus. Labore Hakaya Lebran Dayabaha in the name of Jesus Labo Kabanime and Dayababau Emma Sabine and Dayabaha Lebran Dayababau Emma Shaka Dabineo E Rabbi and Dayababau Emma Sabine and Dayabau Keep on praying, keep on praying, keep on praying, hallelujah in the name of Jesus, hallelujah Emma Kadabia Labine and Dayababau me and Dayabah Emma Sabine and Dayabau Emma Shabane me and Emma Shabarabau in the name of Jesus, Labine and Dayaha, Emma Kabay and Dayababa, we and Dayaba, La Debre and Dayababa, 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 Yanda Bene and Dayaba, Yanda Yababa, in the name of Jesus, child of God, lift up your mouth, lift up your voices, in the name of Jesus, begin to pray, begin to pray. Thank you, Lord. Lebaha, Lebrandaya, Yandaya Baba. The Lord God is with you. Your right hand has been heard. Whatever you declare, whatever you declare, it shall come to pass. In the name of Jesus, La Pakaya Mato Zebre, La Debre and Dayabaha, Emma Shakabaha, Lebran Dayabaha, you will not fear anything, you will not fear anything, you will not fear anything, you will not fear anything. I say you will not fear. Fear will not take control over your life in the name of Jesus. Why? Because you know the power. That is above all powers. It's in you. Hallelujah. It's deposited in you. In case you have forgotten. Bible says the one who is in you. 
Hallelujah. The one who is in you is far greater, praise the name of the Lord, than the world, the things that are in the world. Please take the word of God. In the name of Jesus. Marokabaya. Lebrando sabe, le bosha kada bene andaya, e masa bene andaya ba, le brosha kaba ne maha, la debre andaya ba, wira masa debre andaya ba ba, la debre andaya ba. Jehovah, we thank you. Jehovah, we bless you. In the name of Jesus, that you have given us this power. In the name of Jesus, we give you praise. We command anything that is not of you to disappear. In the name of Jesus, we command them to disappear. We command them to disappear. Don't stop. Don't stop praying. Don't stop praying. Don't stop praying, hallelujah, in the name of Jesus. Don't stop declaring the word of God. Don't stop, in the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Every word that you know in the word, every word that speaks over your situation, concerning your situation, proclaim it. Proclaim it, proclaim it, hallelujah. Proclaim it, what do you want? What do you need? State your case, state your case. God is calling you to state your case. And he says that he will make you acquitted. In the name of Jesus, say what you want. Say what you want. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Bari hakaya. Lebro Shabaha, Emakabaha, Yanda Bere Andayaha, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I believe you all know what some uh, Isaiah 50 45 says. But people of God, let's read it and then we'll probably take it. Hallelujah. Isaiah uh, 45 45. You know what is there. Uh, let, 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 let's take it. Hallelujah. Even if you don't know, the, 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 the scripture, amen, you know the word, amen. Thank you, Lord Jesus. You want to pray, we are going to continue to pray for your work with God. Hallelujah, you want to pray that you continue to increase in the Lord. Hallelujah, nothing will be able to bring you down. Child of God, hear and hear again. Not because I am saying it, it's what the word of God says. It's, I'm only confirming God's word, hallelujah, in your life. Nothing will be able, if you don't allow it, no one, hallelujah, devil will work on it and work on it and work on it and work on it. It will not succeed. Hallelujah. It will not succeed. He says that you are like, you are like a tree, a tree, a tree planted. You are like, you are not a tree. You will never be a tree. You are far above trees. Hallelujah. But he says you are like a tree planted by the riverside. What does that mean? The Lord God puts his power every single day through you. Hallelujah. He fuel you with power. He fuel you with, with, with his might in the name of Jesus. May that be your portion. May that be your cover. May that be your strength. In the name of Jesus. And not forgetting. Hallelujah. Isaiah 45. Praise God. Simple. This is what it says. You are the chosen one. I say you are the chosen one. Remember our series that we were going through. Selected by God. Formed by God. Elected by God. Chosen by God. Ah, ah. Child of God, you are blessed. Child of God, you are blessed. I say you are blessed. No weapon is, yes, you've heard it again and again and again. But that is the truth. That is the truth. Hallelujah. No weapon fashioned against you shall prosper. No weapon fashioned against you shall prosper. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. No weapon fashioned against you shall prosper. But now let's look into, into the word of God. It says, this is what the Lord says to you. You can put your name there. Isaiah 45, verse number one. Write it down. When we finish, go and read it and continue to pray. The word of God. If you don't want this, and you want news that will scare you, you want news that will, I mean, cause your whole life, we giving you sleepless night. No, that is not true. Child of God, that is not how God calls us to behave. Praise the name of the Lord. 
Hallelujah. I'm not trying to be something. But sometimes it looks as if we, we are panicking too much. And the, in the panic, it's like we are forgetting what God actually has said concerning us. Well, that's my statement. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. But it says, this is what the Lord says to you and to me. He's anointed. You've been anointed. Jesus said, the anointing of the Lord is upon me. I have been ordained. The power of God is upon you. You have been ordained. You have been called. You have been chosen. You have been selected. You have been elected. Oh, child of God, be happy. I say be happy. Happy in the name of the Lord. That's what I mean. Not happy sitting down doing nothing. Happy in the name of the Lord. That the one who is with you, he's not going to leave you. He's not going to forsake you. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. And he says, yes, whose right hand I have empowered. God has empowered your right hand. Right hand means authority. Bible says all authority has been given unto us. Authority. It says before him, I will bring down kings and will paralyze with fear. Their fortress gates will be open and never to be shut again. You need to trust God. I don't have more time for us to read it through, but please, when you done, go through it. Hallelujah. But he says, this is what the Lord says. I will go before you. You don't need this. What do you want? God says, I will go before you. Just have faith in this word. That God himself has said, hallelujah, not the church, not anybody, but God said, I have said, hallelujah, I will go before you. That is why still, though that they close the doors of the church, hallelujah, amen. But people are still praying. People are still seeking the face of God. Yes, we are missing the, the fellowship, hallelujah. But the anointing of God, the power of God is still moving in the name of Jesus. Because you are anointed in the name of Jesus. He says, I will go before you and level the mountains and smash down the gates of bronze and cut through the bars of iron i don't have time to go on there are it's loaded hallelujah with faith speaking words praise the name of the lord that is what we need to go after faith words hallelujah shall we begin to pray lift up your hands wherever you are and declare in the name of jesus i will not die i will live and declare the words of the Lord. I will not die. You are speaking favor. You are speaking goodness. There is a mark, hallelujah, of the Holy Ghost. There is a mark. The righteous, hallelujah, will flourish. The Lord God is not going to destroy the righteous with the wicked. Hear me out. God is not going to destroy the righteous with the wicked. You are selected in the name of Jesus, hallelujah. I say you have been called by God. He says he will go before you. Let God lead you everywhere you go. Let the anointing of God follow you wherever you go. The Holy Ghost is with you in your house, in your going out, in your coming in, in the name of Jesus. God is with you. Make him to pray, hallelujah. Labayankaya. Lebro kabaha, yando kosa debe, le mata bene andayabaha, la debre andayabaha, yebo shakaya. Lebro sandebre, yandebre andayabaha. Mighty God, we thank you. Mighty God, we bless you. Mighty God, we glorify you. Yes, you say you will go before us. Every mountain will be brought low in the name of Jesus. Bronze gate, iron pass, whatever the wicked one is putting together, we destroy it in the name of Jesus. The church, the body of Christ will continue to march on in the name of Jesus. Labaya, 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 Labaya. 
Labaya, Labaya, E Makabane Mene Andayaba, E Masabene Andayaba, E Mashabare Mama, E Makababo, E Masabene Andayaba. We give you praise, Lord. We give you glory, Lord. We magnify your name, O Lord. Yada Beneba, for the victory you have given unto us. In the name of Jesus, we honor you, mighty God. Keep on praying by declaring the favor of God over your life, your loved ones, our nation, our prime minister, all those that are not well, we declare them well. They will not die. They will not die. They will not die. Even if the wicked one wants them dead, they will not die. They will not die. We call the resurrection power, the power that raised Jesus from death to lift them up from their dead and sick beds in the name of Jesus. We empower them with the power of the Holy Ghost. We send forth in the name of Jesus. Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus. The word of God to reach out in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. It says that when we mention the name of the Lord, the name of the Lord, the name of the Lord, the name of the Lord is a strong tower. Hallelujah. And guess what? Guess what? This is what you need to understand. He said the name of the Lord is a strong tower. And guess what? Anybody can mention it. Is that what he says? No. He said the name of the Lord is a strong tower and only the righteous have access to it. In the name of Jesus, only the righteous, you and I, have access to the power of God, the name of God. Let us use it. Let us use it. In the name of Jesus, Marabaha, Labayabaha, every mountain, Every problem, every sickness, every defeat, we are turning it around. We are calling it to be turned around. Turn it around in the name of Jesus. Labore Kabaha. Labora Bene Andaya. Lemo Shakayaba. Yanda pray all kinds of prayers. In the name of Jesus. All kinds of prayers. In the name of Jesus. Pray all kinds of prayers. In the name of Jesus. Declare, declare all kinds of prayers. La de Makayaha, E Mashaba de Manabo, E Masabene Andayaba, Yantabene Andayaba. If you can pray in tongues, just pray in tongues in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Labo, 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 Labo. In the name of Jesus. Lebro Kabaha, La Bene Andayaba, Bori Andaya, Labori Andayaba. In the name of Jesus. The Lord said he will go before you. He said that he will make all the crooked places. All the rough places. Hallelujah. God is going with us. So we declare. We declare. We proclaim. In the name of Jesus. So shall it be. In Jesus' mighty name. You will not fear. Arrows that fly by day. You will not fear. You will not fear. You will not fear. In the name of Jesus. You will speak. You will speak. You will act. In the name of Jesus. You will behave as a child of God. In the name of Jesus. Under the anointing of the Holy Ghost. 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 In the name of Jesus. The Lord God is with you. Father, we thank you. Father, we bless you. We honor you in Jesus' name. We want to pray for the church, the churches. Hallelujah. Let's start from our side. We want to pray for all the church members and we connect all the body of Christ. People will be strong. Listen to this. People will be strong. We will be strong in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We will not die, but we will live. We will proclaim. Hallelujah. We are coming back strong, powerful, in the name of Jesus. We are coming back with a loving spirit. Hallelujah. I'm telling you, it's going to be divine, powerful, in the name of Jesus. We are coming back, amen, with enormous power, in the name of Jesus. <coughs> in the name of Jesus. 
Father, we thank you. Shall we begin to pray? La Kabaya. Every single one. Every single one. All the believers, our pastors, our bishops, hallelujah, our leaders, we commit all of them into the hands of God. They are charging. They are coming back strong in the name of Jesus with great leadership skills in the name of Jesus with great unity in the spirit in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Marakada the blood of Jesus being a mark we will pass over in the name of Jesus I said we will pass over in the name of Jesus in the in Jesus name in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus Hallelujah. You know, finally, we pray. You know, Bible says yes, that Jesus said to his disciples, let us cross over. Let us cross over. Listen, there is a place God is taking us. Amen. Even if we are to go back to the Old Testament, God said, I am going to take you to a place. But along the line, so many things happen. Hallelujah. So many things. So many things. So in this dispensation, hallelujah, Jesus said he will come for us. He will come for us. But in between, so many things will happen. I said so many things will happen. But don't be afraid. That should not be your problem. Hallelujah. But when Jesus promised that, let us cross to the other side, Bible says that storm came, this thing came, that came. They were, it looks as if they were going to drown. But at the end of the day, what happened? What happened? They ended up where he said they were going. Now lift up your hands. I want you to pray for yourself. For yourself. For yourself. If you are hearing me right now, I want you to pray for yourself. That you will be strong. You will be courageous. In the name of Jesus, you will take the word of God. Hallelujah. And you begin to move. Shall we begin to pray? Pray for yourself. Pray for your family. Pray for your children. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Le baka debre andayaba. Yando shaka debe. Le branda yababa. Yes, oh Lord, we thank you. You are on our side. So we will not fear. Your word says that you have not given us the spirit of fear. Fear is not our portion. Fear we command you to go. In the name of Jesus. Our minds will always be on our God. In the name of Jesus, he is our king. He is our deliverer. In the name of Jesus, mighty God, we thank you. We bless you. We honor you. In the mighty name of Jesus, hallelujah, for giving us such a wonderful time in your presence. May your name be exalted. May your name be glorified in Jesus' mighty name. We know our prayers have been a wonderful before you and mountains have come down and valleys have been leveled in the name of Jesus. We give you praise. We give you glory in Jesus' mighty name. We have prayed. God bless you. God bless you. God bless bless you. Don't sign off yet. Hallelujah. Please remember hallelujah, this is hour of faith. We do it every Wednesday. But this evening because of the fasting, we are coming back at 6 p.m. Don't, 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 don't distance yourself. And please, with all due respect, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Don't break the fast. Hallelujah. Let's keep on praying. Let's keep on praying. Hallelujah. We are coming your way 6 p.m. It's going to be wonderful. Tell a friend. Hallelujah. God is going to continue to move because the anointing of God, the power of God is moving. It's moving. It's moving. In the name of Jesus, continue to stay in the presence of God. Hear news that will encourage you. Listen to news that will empower you for you to know that God is still at work in the name of Jesus. We love you.
We love you. As I said, we are missing you. Hallelujah. But we are still together in the spirit. In Jesus' name. Until then, may the Lord keep you. May the Lord favor you. May his face shine upon you all the days of your life. Stay strong. Stay courageous. Stay strong in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We love you. God bless you. Let's share the grace. Now may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, be with us all, wherever you are, wherever you are, we are still together in the Spirit. Hallelujah. Amen. Now, declare, surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of God. Hallelujah forever and ever. Amen. God bless you.